Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to convert Minecraft into the ultimate survival game. You're essentially going to be fighting for your life about 90% of the time, and overall it'll just be far more challenging. So anyways, let's go ahead and get into the video. Alright, the first mod we're going to be installing is the Tough as Nails mod, and this mod makes it so in order to survive you actually have to drink water now, and you also have to watch the temperature because if it gets too cold or hot, you're going to start dying. And this just makes it so you're going to have to be much more prepared depending on where you're going. Next up, we're either going to be installing Wild Nature or Wasteland Reborn, and both of these are world generation mods, and depending on which one you choose, you just have to select its world generation type. And if you're going to be using Wild Nature, be sure to select the preset I have selected, and disable lakes, and you don't really have to do this, but it actually works pretty nicely with Tough as Nails, because when you have to find water and there isn't much water to go around, it does make the game quite a bit harder. The next mod up is Epic Siege mod, and this makes all the mobs in the game have essentially more abilities than they did before. For example, if you try to run away from zombies and hide inside of your house, they'll just break down your walls, or if you try and build super high, they'll build after you, and this mod just makes mobs much tougher than they were before. Up next, we have a Crude Start mod, and this mod makes it so little stones and sticks will spawn on the ground, and with these you can make very simple tools, and this mod is actually going to be helpful for the next mod on this list. Up next, which is the mod I just mentioned, is the Punch Me Not mod, and this mod makes it so whenever you hit pretty much anything with your fists, it'll actually damage you. And so while you still can try to break down trees with your hands, you'll lose a lot of health doing it. And overall, this mod just works really well with a crude start. The next mod we have is the General Disasters mod, and this mod makes it so in your world there can actually be earthquakes, sinkholes, and volcanoes, and these can happen essentially anywhere, so you could be building a house and then out of nowhere a sinkhole appears beneath you, and this just definitely mixes things up. Weather Storms and Tornadoes is the next mod we will be installing, and this mod adds much more severe weather to your game, ranging from simple rainstorms all the way up to giant tornadoes, and these can actually cause damage to your world, so just like the General Disasters mod, with this mod installed, you'll always have to be prepared for everything. Next up is the Hardcore or darkness mod, and when you have this mod installed, you better make sure you have some torches whenever you're outside and it's dark, or you're inside a cave, because you cannot see anything if you don't. This mod completely removes the minimum light level in Minecraft, so you can find yourself in complete darkness. One of the last mods I have on this list is the Animalium mod, and this mod adds a couple new hostile creatures to your world, and some of these actually have their own special little abilities, for example, the rats will take whatever you're holding in your hand and run away with it. The last mod I have for you guys is the Enhanced Visuals mod, and this mod adds a couple visual overlays to your game depending on what happens to you, whenever you take damage you'll actually see blood splatter onto your screen, and this mod even has a couple extra effects provided for the Tough as Nails mod. Alright, now that I've shown you all the mods, here's some gameplay of all the mods together. Alright, that's the end of this video, and there's still quite a bit more mods that could fit onto this list, so if there's any you think I should have included, definitely post them below so everyone can check them out. And if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and until next time, thanks for watching.